Howdy, Fixer here, and welcome back to Thimbleweed Park. Now, before I get started, I want to show you guys something. The options menu. Very exciting, right? First thing is... Okay, well, first thing is, actually... There's no resolution options in here. There's, there's nothing as far as video goes besides full screen. And that's... That's no bueno. That should not be the case. Resolution, please. Oh my god. Anyways, toilet paper over. And I want to give you a, a quick story about this. Um, about, I don't know, maybe two months ago. It was probably in February, maybe January. Somewhere along those lines. The devs were posting screen, screenshots of the game, as they often did during development. And Because and, I followed and I saw many of them. One of them was of a bathroom with a toilet roll of toilet paper. And the, the toilet paper, and I don't even remember the original screenshot, but an argument, a lighthearted argument ensued about the toilet paper because the one side of people said that the toilet paper is supposed to go under, the other side says it's supposed to go over. And there was a huge argument, there's a huge to-do about it, on um, which way the toilet paper should have been. So the devs like, you know what, screw this. We're putting an option in the game to put the toilet paper over or under to make sure that you're not going to be freaking out when you see it in the game. So that's what that is. And of course, I'm a toilet paper over kind of guy. Because that's the right way to do it. And I'm going to turn that on. Anyways, we are heading into town. And we are going into the cemetery. You know one, th one thing that I think would be pretty awesome, and I wonder if it can be done. I need to stay focused and solve this murder so I can do what I need to do. I, I know this. Um, one thing that would be nice, and, and I don't... That's the second time he's done something like that. I would like to be able to select both people and move them at the same time. That would be kind of cool. So I didn't have to bring him one at a time over to the cemetery. Where is the cemetery? Okay, here it is. Yeah, can I just... Oops. No. I can't. Alright, well. Let's, uh... Let's take, um... Ray in here. Path to the highway. Okay. Doesn't seem to be anything I can interact with here, eh? Just the path? Hello. Nothing over here either, eh? Yeah, there's nothing! Let me look at some names at least! Be silly! Okay, this is a long ways to travel. Hopefully there is a way to quick travel. That's right, there is. I forgot, you can right click. Oh. There's literally nothing to interact with here. What am I doing? What, where am I? Oh, I see. This is taking forever. A tomb! The heavy wrought iron gate is closed. I see a switch inside. Of course there's a switch inside. Flowers left over from a funeral. Oh, she she was able to pick one up. I, I didn't think she would. I don't need more flowers. Okay. Hold them. I don't need more flowers. So, in, in Maniac Mansion, left over from a funeral. I wonder if this game's going to be the same. There, in Maniac Mansion, there was one character who had flexible morals, let's say, and and she was able to do something that the others were not. And, and that was, um, I'm going to give you just, in fact, if I'm going to walk all the way back. It's an empty soda bottle. Five cent oh. deposit. In Michigan, Hawaii, California, Arkansas, Idaho, Wisconsin, Nevada, Georgia, Virginia, Connecticut, Vermont, Maryland, Kansas, North Carolina, Texas, Montana, Tennessee, South Dakota, District of Columbia, Florida, South Carolina, Washington, Arizona, Montana, oh, for the love of New God. Jersey, Utah, Delaware, Kentucky, Maine, 
Ohio, Mississippi, Illinois, North Dakota, Nebraska, Arkansas, Colorado, Louisiana, New York, New Mexico, Missouri, West Virginia, Rhode Island, New Hampshire, Iowa, Wyoming, Pennsylvania, Oklahoma, Oregon, Indiana, Alabama, and Michigan. Now, did she say some of those more than once? I would like to point out that it appears that this game is going for some kind of accuracy for 1987. However, I don't think Michigan was the five cent refund in 87. I'm fairly certain they had the 10 cent refund at that point in time. Because you get a can on it, it'll say all these states five cent, but Michigan would be set aside and it'll say 10 cents. And I'm pretty sure that was implemented before 87. I, I could be wrong though. But That's the highway into town. Yeah, I know. I'm going that way, girl. Oh, look at me. I'm, I'm all about running now. We're in town! Okay. So this is my... F was it? Does that mean someone was watching us? I have no idea what that means. Wait for me. Uh, 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 it's all right. I'm here. It says Main Street. Oh, let's give a flower to him. Uh, give flower to Reyes. Oh, I love carrying stuff. Oh my god, freaking guys can't take a hint. All right, let's go. It's dark, but I can see there's nothing in there. Willie's Watch and Violin Repair Shop. Thimbleweed County's most exclusive watch and violin repair. We repair watches and violins for the rich or famous. Interesting combo. Is that a dog in game or is that my neighbor's dog? Jesus Christ. Is it? Wait, hold on. I think that's in game. Closed. Looks like they cleared out in a hurry. Bust? Ride the bust? So we've got a worn down town. That seems to be a, a pretty large theming. Oh! Howdy! I'm the Thimbleweed Park Sheriff. Hi. I don't remember calling the Federinos. Eh, that's what you are, Feds. Hard to miss the government issue suits. <laughs> As he says, sitting there with a state issued suit. Asshole. Alright. Damn straight, we're the Feds. Cut the Mayberry crap. We're taking over this case. I love it. I'm Agent Ray, and this is, uh, my partner? No, any good place that serves good pie. Jeez, that's not a reference, is it? Um, okay, well, I'm going with that. Know any place that serves good pie? Nah, uh, you could try the diner down the street, but no one eats there. That's fantastic. Botulism. <laughs> that's from, uh, Twin Peaks, in case you guys don't know. Cut the Mayberry crap. We're taking over this case. Whoa! Hold your horse, Reno's. No need to get snippy. Damn straight. Looks like you heard about our little murder Reno out by the bridge, huh? There is nothing little about murder, sir. <sighs> Ignore him. He's new. <laughs> no sense in wasting everyone's time, Reno. This cutscene is starting to get long, and it's only gonna get longer. Well, let's find the coroner and uh, get you on your way. I get you. Wrestling starts at eight. Oh God! I hope he's talking about on TV. Nope, he's gonna wrestle you. The coroner is waiting for you in his office. Come see me when you're done. I apologize, Areno, for all the lights being off. We don't stay open as long as you city slick Arenos do at night. Even for a murder? Especially for murder. <laughs> that makes no sense. Are we authorized to shoot people, Arenos? The inscription says, Pillotronics, the brain of our city. Pillotronics? Is it... <laughs> That's fantastic. <sighs> That's so obnoxious, I love it. All right, what else do we have here? Can I, is there, oh. 
Nothing else to see here? Nothing? Bueller? No? Alright, let's go in then. Howdy who! I'm the Thimbleweed Park Coroner. What's with the coins, Welcome man? Welcome to the future who. Who? All right. Oh, these are the latest in crime-fighting computers made by Pillowtronics, Inc. This is all probably pretty advanced, even for the Fedahoos. Oh, do enlighten us. <laughs> I love your sarcastic humor, who, Agent Ray. It's not humor. <laughs> there you go again. We're interested in any help your computers can give us. They look marvelous. <sighs> <laughs> yes, happy to explain. So happy to explain who. Yeah, you might want to take notes. Already on it. Tell us about the Bloodtron, the Fingertron, the Facetron. Aren't you the Sheriff of Reno? Aren't you the Sheriff of Reno? Oh my, no. <laughs> no, 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 who. Well, people say there is some resemblance around the eyes. But we're as different as peas of who's in a pot of who. That's a good Plus, point. the sheriff has that annoying areno he adds to everything. You'll never hear me doing that, who? Sure. Whatever. That's a very, very good point. I did not notice until he mentioned it. It's the same freaking guy. I just felt like everybody's obnoxious. Um... Tell us about the Bloodtron 3000. This is the Bloodtron 3000. Put two bloody objects in, and it will match the blood type, printing out a report to who. Um, okay. Tell us about the Fingertron 3000. Right, Arino, the Fingertron 3000. Insert a fingerprint registry of known criminals and a fingerprint from the murder weapon on fingerprint tape, and it will do a match of who. Oh, tell us about the Facetron 3000. The Facetron 3000. Or, as I like to call it. Let me guess. The face of Reno? The face of who? <laughs> no, that's what the sheriff calls it. You who city folk of who crack me up. Just insert two pictures of an individual and it will verify a positive match. <laughs> if you have the, you, That's ridiculous. All did right. you use these computers to investigate the pillow factory fire? Oh, sure did. Four computers positively showed the fire was caused by the factory guard. No doubt a who about it. Could the computers have been wrong about the fire? Not these computers. Oh, the state of the art of who computers made by Pillowtronics. Absolutely infallible. Mm hmm. Isn't there a conflict of interest with Pillowtronics and the fire? Whoa, now. Pillowtronics and its founder, Chuck, are above reproach. Chuck. Chuck built this town and was a computer and pillow genius. And dead. Are the feds uh, looking into this case? It was solved uh, 20 years ago. No, he's just curious. He's a pillow factory fire buff. He's got a CompuServe chat room and everything. <laughs> All right. Fascinating stuff. I think we've heard enough. This is all very impressive, sir. This should cut hours of our investigation. <sighs> hey, go see the sheriff in his office for a full explanation of the amazing Arrestron 3000. I have some paperwork to do, who? Oh, yeah, almost forgot. Uh, these Tron machines are fully voice activated, so if you need any information, just talk to them. It's like we're living in the futuristic year of 2017. <laughs> That's funny. All right. No, I don't want to leave. I hate this town. Let's investigate these Tron machines, then go see the sheriff and get out of here. It's empty. It's empty. There's a fingerprint kit here. Hello? There's a fingerprint brush, a small amount of fingerprint powder, but it's missing the fingerprint tape. Okay. It's a medical skeleton. Please return to Dr. Fred. Nah, it's a maniac mansion reference. Dr. Fred owned the mansion. Chewy Caramel Center. Ugh. Awarded to Dr. Mort E. Shun by Sheriff Crook. Mortician? Lots of medical books there. Okay. Well, let's take a look at this guy's feet. Can I do that or no? That's just in the foreground then? 
Okay. Um. Maybe they should call it Vampire Tron. Okay. Um, what's 2 plus 2? Describe your primary function. The primary function of the Blood Tron 3000 trademark patent pending is to analyze a blood sample and a bloody object to ensure arrest of a suspect. Okay. Procure a slob or other absorbent material and dab some blood on it. Insert a blood sample taken from a body along with a bloody object and I, I mean the Blood Tron 3000 trademark, will confirm a positive match. Alright. Or... Awesome. Thirty-two million nine hundred and twenty-one thousand and fifty-six. <laughs> okay. Eight point one eight five three five two seven seven two. Calculate. Uh oh. Calculate. Did I break it? Calculate. I may have broken it. Calculate. Oh no. Calculate. Calculate. It's not good. Five. Five. No. Wait. Seven. Yeah. Whatever. He's full of shit. All right. Locked off. Um, I guess I got to do each one of these. I then. don't want to pick that up. Oh, I didn't want to pick it up. I want. Oops. Well, we'll do that one first. Yes. Now I asked if he knew the three laws of robotics. What are the three laws of robotics? The robot must obey the orders given it by human beings, except where such orders would conflict with the first law. Three, the robot must protect its own existence as long as such protection does not conflict with the first or second laws. Four, party like it's 1999. <laughs> I don't think it's, it's one of them. Alright, what's your primary function? The primary function of the phase drawn 3000. Trademark is to analyze a photograph of a dead body and compare it with an official photographic ID to provide a positive identification of the victim. Sounds fair. Where do I get a photograph of a dead body? What kind of official identification? Identification? Oh, 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 oh! I need his wallet. I don't have his wallet. Based on three thousand trademark requires official government identification that contains a photograph of the victim. All right. Sure. Whatever. So, <laughs> um, I'm going to execute a uh, return opcode and leave now. All right. Let's talk to this guy and then we're off. How far from Duluth, Minnesota, is Phillipsburg, Pennsylvania? Miles. Where does Simbleweed Park take place? What state? I'm not even sure. I wonder. How many miles from the Earth to the Sun? The average distance from the Earth to the Sun is 93,000 miles. Um, 93,000? That doesn't sound like a lot, does it? That can't be right, is it? That sounds like, that sounds like too little. At its closest orbit, the Sun is 91.4 million miles from the Earth. Okay. The Andromeda galaxy is around two million light years away. Right. How much wood would a woodchuck chuck but woodchuck could chuck wood? Seriously, <laughs> I've been playing too many adventure games. Uh-huh. Describe the primary function. The primary function of the Faker Tron 3000 trademark is to analyze a fingerprint and find a match in the registry of known criminals and produce a report for the arrest Tron 3000 trademark. Thank you for all of that. Um, how do I take a fingerprint? Using official government issue fingerprint tape, place it on an object with fingerprints, and the fingerprint will be transferred. I need tape. It's around here somewhere. I'm not going to solve this whole crime for <laughs> you. You're probably the kind of person that uses a hint guide, aren't you? Um, there's no hint guide yet. There isn't. This game's brand new. Where do I find a registry of known criminals? Okay, let's just leave. So I've got a fingerprint kit, but I need tape. And I think that's all we've... Ooh, a certificate? Awarded to Dr. Mort E. Shun. Oh. 
by yeah. Sheriff Crook. It's a very dark and smelly flight of stairs leading up to the door. Does that mean you won't? It's a very dark and smelly flight of stairs leading up to the door. What? Raise to do list. Find the murder weapon. Fingerprint the murder weapon. Get Fingertron report. Find ID for the victim in hotel. Get Facetron report. Take a blood swab from the body. Find suspicious item with blood on it. Get Bloodtron report. Put three reports in a restaurant. So that's basically, well, I mean, it's literally a to-do list. So what am I missing then? Because I don't wait. Hold I on. I need to stay focused and solve this murder so I can do what I need to do. Atari cartridge. Because, I mean, I've got this photo, but I need more than that. Dead ringer for the body. Oh. Okay. Um. Um. That did nothing. Okay. It has the photo of the dead body. Okay, so basically it needs a government ID then. Is that what it was waiting for me to do before I leave? It's a very dark and smelly flight of stairs leading up to the door. What the shit is it waiting for then? I don't have anything else. I don't have fingerprints, do I? Oh, hold on. Well, it doesn't matter because I don't have tape. I got a stupid flower. There's a fingerprint brush, a small amount of fingerprint powder, but it's missing the fingerprint tape. Lots of medical books there. Was my phone ringing? What well, what's going on? Ah! You know Sorry, but we're out to dinner. Call back next week. Nice. All right. Come on. It's got to be something, right? I'm I'm doing it. Okay, that's a We're sorry. The number you have dialed is not in service at this time. Why is that green? It feels like I have a message or something. Look. Um, I don't know. So what do I got to do to get out of here? They they won't let me leave. Lock the drawer. It's a medical skeleton. Please return to Dr. Fred. Oh, well now it lets me leave. Whatever. All right, let's go here and talk to the sheriff. Hi. Hello again, Agent Areno. Uh-huh. Hopefully the coroner fills you in on our state of the art Areno computers. He did indeed. You mean the I'm you I mean the coroner said something about the Aristotron? You're also the coroner, right? Oh my no! <laughs> no 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 Arino. People say there is some resemblance around the eyes, but we're as different as peas arenos in a pot arino. Plus the coroner has that annoying ahoo he adds to everything. <laughs> You'll never hear me doing that, Arino. Right. That's some very serious computing power you've got there. Yes, sir, Reno. It's all state-of-the-art computer Renos from Pillowtronics. Absolutely infallible. Sounds very not you, infallible. I mean, the coroner said something about the Arrestron. Yes, the Arrestron 3000. The last step in a fully computerized Reno arrest. The final link in the chain of a guaranteed conviction of Reno. Every detail of Reno analyzed and verified by computer. Moving on. Right. Uh, sorry, Reno. I, I get carried away sometimes. This is the big bad boy of Reno you've been hearing about. The Arrestron 3000. Uh, just feed three reports from other Tron machines into this and it issues a 100% Reno valid arrest warrant. Yeah, these machines are the reason we need only one law enforcement officer a Reno. Chuck said that computers will soon put us all out of work, allowing for a full life of luxury. Yep, that's gonna work out well for you. 
Who is this Chuck? Who is this Chuck we keep hearing about? Sadly, Chuck passed away a few days ago. There was a big service out at the cemetery, Reno. Oh, the entire town showed up, which isn't surprising for the hero of Thimbleweed County. We'll talk more about Chuck later. I need to run a Reno and check on a disturbance call out at the old circus. Probably that stupid clown Reno again. That's what clowns do. That's what clowns Looks do. like we need to go talk to the rest of the weirdos that live in this town. We should split up. It will be faster. You cooling your heels in the local diner would also make things go faster. <laughs> if we follow agency questioning protocols, this shouldn't take long. <sighs> okay. Just don't mess anything up. Your face. I want to get out of here as fast as possible. Agreed. Insert three reports from the Bloodtron 3000, Fingertron 3000, and Facetron 3000 into the Arresttron 3000 to issue an arrest. Just a bunch of files. I just need to hear a print book here. Hello. This has fingerprints for everyone in Thimbleweed Park. That's Certified good. Certified to... Fingertron 3000 compatible. Just a bunch of files. Can I lock her in here? Hold on. All right, you stay there while I work. That's awful. You guys Wanted. are awful. Pickle Bill and the Cucumber Gang. Wanted. Huh? A meteor? Uh, that's uh, another Maniac Mansion reference. Wanted. Shady Jane and the Sunshine Gang. A meteor crashed to Earth and controlled Dr. Fred to Just do all the crazy things files. he did. Just a bunch of files. Just a bunch of files. Okay. It's a police radio. Looks like it's on and ready to use. Breaker 1-9, Breaker Breaker. Breaker 1-9, Breaker Breaker. breaker. <laughs> Is this thing on? Daisy, Daisy, give me your answer, do. I'm half crazy, all for the love of you. A bicycle built for two. <laughs> I didn't think it would end. I shouldn't be using official county equipment. It doesn't have any buttons. Must be. It doesn't have any buttons. Must be for incoming calls only. It doesn't have any buttons. Fine. Must be for incoming calls only. All right, I won't be mean. Come with me. All right, where are we going now? We still need tape, right? That's the one thing I don't... There's a vacuum tube it's up there. It's a pretty big vacuum tube. It's turned off. Oh. Um... Use... We interrupt our hostile takeover non-stop music with this important message. Wake up, people! The government is stealing your right to free will. And now back to our special hostile takeover song. Oh, hopefully this doesn't give me uh, any kind of copyright mark. It's a pretty big vacuum tube. I might break the tube. That was kind of the idea there, Chief. Is that it? No donuts? Okay. So, does that mean we're, we're ready to head out into the town? Oh, look who's here. Alright, let's grab... Not that. Let's grab Agent Ray and head out... Great. And head outside as well. And we'll we'll start our investigation of the town. I think next episode. Yeah, this looks good. Time was running out, I guess. All right. Well, thank you guys for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye bye.